Good morning, YouTube. Saturday, 28th, I think. And out here working with my rabbits. Been gone all week and uh, had a doe that was so supposed to kindle on uh, Tuesday, her first litter. And uh, she kindled last night. And I don't know how cold it was last night. It's in the 20s right now. Lower 20s, 24, 25 degrees. And uh, she had a litter of five nice kits. But uh, we lost all those. A little bit bummed about that. But better to lose them on their first day, I guess. Anyways, cold weather. It's, this weather's been up and down. It's been in the 60s last week, and now it's down in the 20s. And uh, kind of hard to plan. And it's part of it, you know, raising animals in the cold. This kind of happens, but <clears throat> certainly don't enjoy it. I wish I would have known. <laughs> if I could have known, maybe I would have could have done something different. Anyways. Let me turn this camera around. I'll show you my uh, kits that are four weeks old. They have about doubled in size in the last week, it looks like. So hold on one second. You can see they're hitting the pellets pretty hard with mom. Mom's black, so you're really not going to see her all that well. They're pretty good size probably be pulling that nesting box out here in another uh, maybe give them a few more days but they really don't need it and all six of them all piled up there on the feeder <laughs> I know they've been getting enough food they just uh, yeah, that's just how they are there's mama you're doing a good job there mama this is my doe that lost the kits I was really looking forward to see if I can get that focus. There we go. The kits that she had, most of them were uh, a dark color. Be interesting to see the color scheme when when she has her next batch. She pulled plenty of fur and everything, but they just got on that wire. The bottom of the nesting box. There's straw in there and and fur but that's how it is in the winter my two bucks you can't really see her but she'll be kindling in a couple weeks so I'm back at it and uh, I haven't got online yet to see what other maple sap producers are or syrup producers are thinking about the weather but I gotta get everything around for that and uh, I'm ready I'm ready for warmer weather it's usually by the end of January I'm done with winter but it is Indiana so anyways hope you have a great weekend thanks for watching thanks for subscribing liking and sharing videos hope whatever you're working on is going well hope you're doing it your way God bless. And just for those who are interested, I know not all the homesteaders that follow me are interested in why I'm smoking, but Missouri Meersham, hardwood. Virginia Parique Flake from McClellan. Not bad. pretty cold out here <laughs> oh man I'm ready for spring <laughs>